What games do you plan on doing after Jack 3 other than Tide 2 and Jack... What the <laughs> fuck? Let me read that again. Oh yeah. What games do you plan on doing after Ratchet Clank 3 other than Tide 2 and Jack 3? I never said I was doing Jack 3. Well, I kind of did, but eh. Right. I've actually got one coming up after Jet Ratchet and Clank 3 that isn't tied to. Um, probably going to get a lot of hate mail anyway saying, what? why no tie 2? Why you upload this game? It looks crap. But yeah, that's going up anyway. Um, but I'm not sure. I just really do what I feel like and what I like playing, you know. So I've got a couple of ideas. I've got quite a few games that I would do. But I'm, it just comes down to picking one. I'm not sure what I would pick, you know. What's your fav favorite Jack game out of all of them? All of them, Jack, Jack, Daxter, Jack, 1, 2, 3, and that racing one that I hate. Probably Jack and Daxter 1 at this point. It used to be Jack 2, but after going back after that LP, I wasn't really that keen now, so probably Jack 1. Also, I think you should put your dog in the camera. I should have, I. Uh, what's your favorite playthrough of yours? Oh, that's another, or another LPers. Um, the best LP I've ever watched. I don't watch too many LPs now, to be honest. Uh, I don't know. Um, I guess I shouldn't say anyway, you know, because of favoritism and that, but, yeah. Mm. Right, do you read much, and if you do, what's your favourite author, series of books, genre? I don't read much, I'll be honest. Uh, last time I read a book was ages ago, so yeah. <coughs> um, have you ever watched Mystery Science Theater 3000? Ah, uh, yeah, can't say I have, sorry. Um, sorry for getting the noise there, I was going to tap the wire there or something. Um, just looking for the. What games are you looking forward to being released in the future? Like I said, Brutal Legend, The Last Guardian, definitely. Crap, actually. I just replied that in a previous video, probably about two videos from now by now, that my most recently anticipated game was Brutal Legend, but it actually is The Last Guardian, because it's from the makers of Ico and Shadow of the Colossus. But yeah, okay. How about those two, then? Those two are my most anticipated right now. Probably Super Mario Galaxy 2, just because I like the first one so much. <coughs> My voice is really starting to get tired. How long have I been talking for? 50 fucking minutes. My god. 50 minutes. You guys are either on part 5 or on part 6 right now. Oh god, and I'm barely halfway through the comments. Why did you all do this to me? Oh, if you're still watching this, sheesh. Are you going to do Xbox 360 games? Maybe one day. Want to know what kind of camera you had because it's so good quality. I've got a GVC, I don't know, it's just a standard camera. It's actually quite pish because uh, the camera doesn't actually, isn't compatible with Windows, so I've got to convert it and then upload it, but my video conversion software isn't actually working right now, so that video I uploaded was actually like half a gig big, which was really annoying, took ages to upload, you know. Uh, what was your favourite game when you were younger? Probably Sonic on the Mega Drive, you know, Sonic... One, two, and three, and knuckles, you know. Um, what do you think the next three new games you'll be getting will be, Ducky? I don't know. Actually, from what's out right now, I really want Star Ocean 4 and Tales of Vesperia. Tales of Vesperia, I know, is going to be good. Star Ocean, I don't know why I should give a chance because uh, Square Enix has been shite recently. But. Uh, it looks good. I've actually played a little bit of it, and that looks good. And also, what else is it the new? That another Code R, that point-click adventure game on the Wii. I don't think it's out in America yet, actually, but I'd like that as well. Uh, there's probably a bunch of others that I can't quite think of right now, but yeah, probably those three, if you want to know. After Tide 2, will you do Jack 3 or Ratchet Gladiator, for fuck's sake? Right, um... Why did you choose the name Scottish Duck? Because something else Duck was already taken when I was signing up to Xbox Live, so I just put in Scottish, and that's pretty much why I have it. Uh, do Sly 1? No. Well, maybe one day. I don't know. Depends if I get it. Uh, are 
How are you going to do Ratchet Deadlocked or skip the tools of description? Why is everyone asking this? Uh, I haven't seen you do many 360 games, that's because I haven't done any. I was your 3000 subscriber, you're like the fifth person to tell me that. Where did you get that Shenmue poster? Um, I actually got it in a magazine years and years and years ago. That poster is actually in really bad condition because I've mucked about with it so much. Loads and loads of sellotape, but I don't want to touch it anymore because uh, I want to keep that poster for ages, you know, basically. Um, uh, what we got here? Do you like cheese? I love cheese. Do you like... or Germany? Never been to Germany, can't say. Final Fantasy X. Final Fantasy X, that game sucks. Sorry. Uh, I didn't like it, alright. When can you LP Mega Man? I'm never going to LP Mega Man, sorry. Uh... Oh my god. My sister is singing in the room next door. Just a minute. Okay, I'm back. Right, I just showed you that my sister right there and like, it's all... Yeah, I'm really glad I didn't hear that. I did move my mic, didn't I? Okay, anyway. Duck, what is your favourite game you have LP'd other than Shenmue? Like I said, DuckTales. Also, who's your favourite lp -er? Can't really say. For favouritism, just check my subscriptions. First time I ever saw your face, I would appreciate it if a spy wasn't sapping my computer. What? I don't know. Um, how was your first experience playing Shenmue in Skies of Arcadia? That's a good question, right? Shenmue, I was at my cousin's house. Um, my cousin was the only other person I knew at the time who had a Dreamcast, you know. And he was playing this new game called Shenmue. And I remember watching it and, like... He had actually gotten to the climax, you know, sort of like the end of disc three, where when the zombie gets kidnapped, you know. Admittingly, that is like the most well-paced and climactic and awesome part of the game, you know. So I kind of got the impression that the whole game was like that. And in a sense, I was kind of disappointed when it wasn't, but overall the game was just that so much incredible that I didn't really mind, you know. So yeah, that was my first time playing Shemu. First time playing Skies. Official Dreamcast magazine came out with a demo. I used to play the demo. And, yeah, I remember, I played it a lot, like, but it was a while before I actually got the game. I got the game when I saw it, and I was like, oh, Skies of Arcadia, I played the demo for this hundreds of times, I should get it. And, yeah, that was how I played Skies of Arcadia. Uh, right, we're like, my god, I've been recording for like an hour! Ah! What was the first video game you ever remember playing? What do you think about it? Super Mario All-Stars on the SNES? Um, what do you like most in the video games you play? They're fun, okay? They're fun! Uh, yeah, still remember. Uh, still looking. What is your favourite PS2 game? Ratchet and Clank 3, damn it. My voice is going! My fucking voice is going! Oh my god! <laughs> I thought you wear glasses, you mentioned in Ratchet and Clank 2. I do wear glasses, but just when playing games and driving and stuff, you know? Uh, wait, you've replied to your comment, P.S. There's some loser who has 400 pathetic subs called... What? Why would you say that? Alright, congrats. What is your favourite JRPG besides Skies of Arcadia? I already listed them, but probably my, uh, my second favourite is... Paper Mario, The Thousand Year Door. Right, what's your favourite song? Simple Man by Leonard Skinner. That song is amazing. I've played it with my... I used to be in a band and I played it. We played it, you know, and it was like one of the best experiences of my life, really. 